Hey, value traders, did you see the big jump in crude oil prices? Value Trades. I'm Brad Alexander, and in this week's Market Blast Fundamentals, let's take a look at gold, Aussie dollar, dollar CAD, the Dow Jones Industrial Average, and WTI. Over the weekend, many oil producing countries agreed to dramatically cut production, driving prices substantially higher. Let's see if price action fills this gap, and we will look at this from the technical side tomorrow. During most of February and well into the month of March, indices like the Dow Jones Industrial Average fell. During the last half of March, investor attitudes changed with the idea that the Fed would slow down its interest rate rises and perhaps pivot. For this reason, investors and analysts will be watching two different PMIs and three different sets of employment figures, including the U.S. non-farm payrolls. Also, with the Canadian employment figure coming out on the day before, this may set up some interesting opportunities on dollar CAD if the figures go in opposite directions. Keep in mind, however, that most markets and exchanges will be closed this Friday, so we might not get the same volatility we would normally see. Australia will be announcing its interest rate decision Tuesday, and the prediction is for a 0.25% increase. If it comes out higher than that, we may have a good long opportunity on the Australian dollar. The Australian dollar is quite mixed right now, so this gives us more chances to see price action moving temporarily against one of the trends. Of course, with all this US data, we should have plenty of opportunities to trade gold, and we will look at this from the technical side tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to Value Trade Signals, and the link will be in this video's description below. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel and register on the Value Trades website to get notifications on new content as it happens. That's all for now. Happy trading with Value Trades, and we will see you next time. CFDs and FX are leveraged products and your capital may be at risk.